OK OK Daniel, good evening. Susana, hello, how are you? How are you, teacher? Good evening. How's everything? Hi, all fine, thank you. I got. Um, I stay in my house in my house. <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> but it's a I I finished uh, um at uh, five PM at work. <laughs> oh really? That's nice. 
Yes. So you could relax today. Yes, our and the traffic is horrible, teacher. But yes. it's yes, but it's um aproveche. No sé. I took advantage. I took advantage. I took advantage. Uh eh, eh, it's al, I er, early, temprano early. Yes. Okay. I I am um, early come back eh, my house. I, I came back early. I came back I, early to my house. I came back early eh, in my house. That's nice. That's nice. Excellent. So glad to have you here in class. Yes, Sherry. I'm sorry. Is it a Friday? I don't. Uh, I didn't, I didn't uh, connect um, in class, but it's a, uh, I, I, I finish, I finish a uh, layer in my, my work and I connect, no, 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 no. ¿Cómo es conectarme? I couldn't connect. I couldn't I connect. I couldn't connect. But traffic eh, is a... Uh, it's stressful, teacher. Yeah, I know, I know. Well, Susana, welcome to the class. So nice to have you here. Okay, thank you, teacher. Thanks to you. William, hello, how are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How was your weekend? Very well, my weekend, teacher. Uh, this day, I began this, the week. Uh, I had the opportunity to share with some special visit in my world. Okay, that's nice. Yes. So I also went shopping with my family. Oh, that's excellent. Yes, so it's always good cool when you have the opportunity to, to share with your family. Yeah. Yes, uh, there's one activity uh, I like it for me. And in summary, this day is excellent. Day perfect. Okay, great. I'm so glad to hear that. Yes. Excellent. Sorry, Welcome sorry, to the class, sure. Mister. So oh, thank happy you. to hear that everything went fine. Welcome to the class. Thank you for being here. Thank you, teacher. Thanks for you. Erwin, hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. Very good. Thanks for asking. And you? I'm just fine, you know, just fine. Busy as usual, but that's normal. What about you? Okay. How was the weekend for you? Um, very good, very interesting, uh, with a lot of work. Uh, as you know, uh, the weekend is uh, my opportunity to, to work a lot and to sell a lot in the restaurant. And yeah. Well, I was very, very busy. And most on, on Sunday. Um, Saturday was a little uh, down in sales, but interesting. Okay, excellent. Excellent. So glad to hear that you had an interesting weekend. You know, it's it's always good to keep busy. So what about uh, from yesterday to today? Today is slower, I imagine. Well, um, today is the maybe the how do you say inicio de la temporada? The beginning, oh, really? The beginning of the season uh, of sales, of course. 
So maybe uh, this was a very good day. And I uh, finished to work at five o'clock. So okay. I, I, I don't know how, uh, how much we sell. sell. Uh, we sold. We sold. So uh, maybe tomorrow. Until it, tomorrow, I imagine. Yeah, yeah. Maybe it was a. It it, it could be a, a good surprise tomorrow. Let's hope so. It's always good when you have that type of surprises, right? Uh, good type, good kind. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's always good, and I and I mean. Uh, Business are like that. I mean, some days are pretty good, some days are slow. That's normal, right? Today but it's always it's always good when they are good. Yes, yes. Today uh, in the morning when I went to the, my my job, uh, I I have a I had another surprise with the traffic. <laughs> it was around nine o'clock and. Since, since my house in Santo Tomas, from 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 Santo Tomas uh, to near Santa Tecla, it was a terrible, but very very terrible traffic. Okay. Maybe there was there was there was a terrible traffic. Um, a vuelta rueda. Oh really? So you were in the middle of a traffic jam? Yeah. And um, I, I, I was drive, uh, riding my motorcycle, but it wasn't enough <laughs> because, uh, well, it's, it, was, it was really, really uh, heavy. Yeah, that happens, that happens. Well, mister, welcome to the class. Nice having you here too. Thank you, teacher. Nicolas, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How are you? Good I'm evening, fine, everybody. I'm fine. What about you? Uh, I'm fine, teacher. Fine. Well, it's relative. Relative because uh, Saturday uh, with my wife, uh, we needed to buy in the, the mall. And I, I needed a... Uh, a shoes, a pair of shoes, a pair of shoes, and my wife needed uh, article articles for her car. And the Saturday is only for for shopping or for Ooh. buy very articles. Oh it, my it, gosh! It are, is, are you a patient man for shopping? Uh, yes, I, I, I work with my wife. Uh, hey, I need, I, I need a little, little time for, for your, for your needed, and uh, the time is 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 relative in the in the in the woman. Yeah. Uh, I. I and I well because uh, no no problem this uh, this day uh, the activity is is very normal is rare because this day is very normal and Sunday we need a problem song because uh, uh, by. Uh, a a neighborhood with your with your car chukaron uh, oh, crash his car crash his car with with the car of my son Ooh. and uh, all all uh, yesterday no all yes yesterday we need uh, esperar. Wait. We need to wait at the police and for, the police. for 
the police for three hours. Yeah, it's, that's normal. Uh, <laughs> it's sorry, but no, it's normal. <laughs> Oh well. No, when when it's when it's a when it's car crashes, believe me, it's normal. It takes between two yes, and three hours. Is is necessary walk uh with friends for uh, understand the the time uh, understand uh, the presence uh, muy tardada. Yeah. Yeah, but the delays are normal when it's those situations. So sorry to hear it. Nicolas, nice to have you here okay. in class. Thank you for Thank sharing you, teacher. with us. Thanks to you. Thank you. Marta, hello, Marta, how are you? Hi, teacher, good evening. Good, and you? I'm just fine, just fine. Tell me, how was the weekend? Oh, my weekend was a uh, very busy teacher, you know, my, my regular schedule. I went uh, to church, supermarket, I went out for dinner, I did gardening, you know, my regular schedule teacher. And you? My weekend, busy. A little bit busy. Let's see, Saturday, I had to work in the morning, meeting in the afternoon, and then I had a presentation at night with some students. So I finished it like around 7 38. Oh, I was finishing very late. my day. Yeah. Yeah. Sunday, let's see, what did I do? Sunday, oh, Sunday, I had to. I was driving in the morning for my in-laws and in the afternoon, oh, well, I took my, my family for lunch. Oh, to, to nice. Salvador's volcano. Yeah, you know, just to kick it a little bit. <laughs> my son wanted a hamburger, but he wanted a hamburger from a specific place over there. Oh my God. <laughs> Yeah, and you know the funny thing is this: I'm not like a uh, like a mountain person. I'm more like a, I enjoy more going to the beach and stuff. But no, they decided they wanted to go there, so we went there. It was good. Excellent teacher. Yeah, that was my weekend. You know, nothing that exciting. Then I had to pass by the supermarket, and you know how that goes. Going to a supermarket is spending more money. Yeah. But, you know, that's the way it goes. <laughs> yes, teacher. Okay, Marta, welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see. Who else is around? Walter, hello, Walter, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How was the weekend for you? Oh, and the weekend, uh, very, very, a uh, very good teacher. <laughs> and yesterday, um, uh, I watched TV and the final the Mexican food, soccer. Oh, really? Uh, Who yes. won? And. Atlas versus uh, Leon. Okay. And, and the Atlas teacher and the champion after 70 years. <laughs> oh, really? Yes. Well, good for them. That's great. Yes. That's great. So you yeah. enjoyed your weekend, right? Excuse me? You had a good weekend. Ah, yes, teacher. Yes, for me, a uh, 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 very, very, very easy. Well, that's uh, nice. Yes. And this, uh, the beginning, the the tournament. Oh, really? Oh, yes, yes. Oh my God. How was that? Did you win or lose? Oh, lose. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my god, so teacher. Sorry to hear that. And the, and the, and the start the, the tournament is my, my equipment. Uh, my team. My team. My, my team. Uh, a person. Oh, oh my that's god. Bad. Yes. Uh, Fue fácil para otro equipo, sí. Yeah, I can imagine, I can imagine. Yeah, yes. yes. Well, thank you very much, mister, and nice having you here. Welcome, teacher. Let's see, Jose Wilfredo. Hello, how are you, teacher? I'm just fine, just fine. How are you? Everything good, teacher. Thanks to God, one uh, weekend more. And I didn't make anything interesting on my weekend, just work. Well, you know, nowadays, it's good to have a job and to keep on working. Remember, it's December. Yeah, I have to do. Uh, yeah, that's right, teacher. I just you have to do see. some uh, usual uh, activities or tasks. Yeah, and you know, December is, is a very good month for spending. We spend a lot of money in December. Well, most of the people, I don't know in your case. But in my case, December is like oof, complex because the, we get together the, the expenses, the vacation, so it's not- I'm good. sorry, teacher, but I don't know why my- I lost you for a few was... seconds. Yeah, yeah, that's right, teacher. No, I was telling you that it's good to keep busy in December because otherwise, if we get free time in December, man, we end up spending money. Yeah, that's right, teacher. Absolutely correct that. Because I prefer work, teacher, because I can um, earn more money to enjoy on my vacations when I took my vacation because I have uh, 15 days that I choose on the on the calendar days so that's good i prefer to have money for those days that's nice that's nice yeah you know, in my case i have to have well it's mandatory for me vacation december the whole month five weeks terrible all right well, the last five weeks well I yeah did, i know no, actually i start i start vacation uh, the first mm -hmm. week of December, and I get back to work mm -hmm. uh, January the 5th. January the 5th, okay. You start sooner of a year. Yeah, until January the 5th. The 5th yeah. is the day that I'm going to start working. And then I won't stop. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, but it's, oh, well, I mean, as uh, I told you, you the time to work here with us. Yeah. <laughs> I will have a, a, a small vacation from you. We will see when do we start again. Let's hope we can start soon. Mm -hmm. Hey, mister, a pleasure but to have you here. You have to, to... Yes, tell me. Okay, thank you. Oh, uh, I was I was telling you that you have a time to enjoy with your family. Yeah, but the bad thing that I tell you is that I tend to spend too much. That's no good. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's not good at all. Thank you, Mr. Welcome. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, guys, let me get the attendance, please. Uh, Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Thank you. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Claudia Lizette Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. 
Erwin Francisco López Rojas. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present teacher. Lucero Abigail Godínez López. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granado. Present. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. En Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Okay, guys, but enough of you just talking to me. I'll send you to groups. Thank you, Shanira. I'll send you to groups and you're going to tell each other how your weekend was, okay? I'll give you five minutes, just five minutes. Then I will choose some of you to ask you about your classmates' weekends. Okay, guys, please jump into the rooms. Five minutes. Teacher, what is the activity? Just talk about the weekend, how the weekend uh, was. Okay. Thank you. Francisco, let's see what's Francisco. Francisco, hello. Susana. Hello, teacher. I'm nothing, in, not, not any compañero. I don't. I don't There's Francisco have... here. Uh, Hello, no. Francisco. How are you? Hello, no teacher. Hey, Francisco, by the way, uh, uh, I was checking the platform. We need to finish. This teacher. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, this, uh, the last two weeks, uh, I am a uh, uh, very busy teacher, but uh, I, I think uh, tomorrow I am working for in, in that teacher in, in the platform. Okay, let me know if you need any help, okay? Okay, teacher, thank you. You're welcome. Hello, Francisco. Hello, hello. Hello, Susan. Okay. Wait a second. I got two, Fernando. Sí, es que tengo problemas, pero ahorita me desconecto de esto. No problem, no problem. That's okay, okay. Teacher. Yes, William. I'm sorry for the attendance. No problem, no problem. I took it. <laughs> Don't worry, okay? Everything is fine. Okay, I'm here. I had a lot. Decided to participate in the class. <laughs> That's a chance, my friend. Okay. Oh, my French fries, girl. <laughs> Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm just great, just great. Teacher, I have a news. Okay, tell me. I have some news. I have some news. I me. meet. Ah, uh, Yanira, Navelinda, and Roxana. 
I met. I met. Yanira. Saturday in the night. Saturday at night. Okay. So bad influences. And <laughs> <laughs> teacher. There's no, Martha. Teacher. <laughs> Hi Martha, how are you? Hi, teacher. <laughs> oh, so sorry for you, my little party. Bad influences. You know, Martha is just like partying all the time. It's Angelina's face. Who, oh, Maria Alejandra? No, no, my face. I don't know. Never seen it. I don't know. I have never it's seen uh... Martha, you know? Yeah, it's true. Is the one of that never turns on the camera. I did not. Not even yeah. for a second, so. I did face teacher. I don't know. Trust I me. I have never seen. It. Trust me. No, 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 no. They call me Thomas. Alejandra, please tell me. No, because the teacher say that uh, me are very bad influence because no, my dear, they are bad influence for ah, you. Yes, <laughs> I have an angel compared that. <laughs> I can imagine. I can imagine. <laughs> And Walter is just like listening. Oh my gosh, he's worried. <laughs> oh my god, uh, the talking about is interesting. Interesting. <laughs> so, how was uh, the party? Uh, the... Did you dance and stuff? No, teacher, no, please. We eat, eat a lot. A lot. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Obviously, teacher. <laughs> well, let me go check another group, guys. Nice talking to you. Okay, where's Roxana? Where's Roxana? Roxana, I need to tell you off. Tell me, teacher. I need to tell you off. Por qué? Oh, because you know, guys. Wilfredo and Wilfredo, I found out that uh, last Saturday, Roxana, Martha, Mira, and Ambar were, were being a bad, bad influence for Maria Alejandra. What? Not yeah, really. They, had a, they went on a party all night long, no. and Maria Alejandra was like angelically wanting to go home, and they were like, let's go party, let's go party. No, teacher, you, just Shame having you. dinner. Mm -hmm. I don't know. They know look, you, Roxana. Wilfredo, look at that face. Wilfredo, look at that face. Would you believe that? No. <laughs> no. <Hey. laughs> Jose Wilfredo is new in the group. Jose Wilfredo, look at that face. Would you believe that it was an angelic and nothing happened? <laughs> Nah. The horns are growing up. I'm sorry, teacher, but I hear you a really low, a little robotic. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's, it's the interference we get from Roxana's being here in the group, you see? <laughs> no, just having dinner. Some yeah, hours. Sure, sure whatever. Yes. <laughs> Poor little thing. Sure. Yes. Roxana told us that um, uh, last weekend <laughs> she went to she, the, she went to go the over place. there. She went to go shopping. She, she went shopping and um, all weekend. She she went over there because two weeks ago that uh, she she called and go i was on jail in jail in jail in jail yeah in but the weekend, I... the weekend was wild for her i said goodbye to my bonus you know the weekend was a wild one, was a wild one. <laughs> 
<laughs> Shame on you. Shame on you. <laughs> no, teacher. It was a calm weekend. Just shopping, having dinner, lunch, beauty. But you didn't and buy. Uh, no comments, no comments. I'm gone. I better be gone. <laughs> no, I have no, no was a documents. In, no, tenía documents. No, the license, the driver license. The driver life, life is. License. No. License. License. No, no, it, she not. Uh, she didn't. She didn't. She didn't. Uh, and uh, the other, the, 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 the copiloto, uh, the copilot, or what is the name of the other person? The, 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 the passenger. The passenger. Uh, uh, <sighs> the passenger dijo, dijo, how do you say this? Say. 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 I was the driver. What? He was lying. He was lying. Hey, the, the, I'm asking you. So the passenger was lying. Dijo una mentira, pues. Of course, are you sure? And and the 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 other other neighbor, uh, hey Nick, person the driver no is a man is a woman. Ah uh, really? Yes. Ah uh, okay. Uh, we need we need work with the police and uh, we it, it is. Uf, fue, y was. was necessary uh, explain explain the 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 reality of or of the the reality and these persons uh, se pusieron nerviosos mm. got nervous okay got Got nervous and the the el acuerdo. The agreement. We, sorry. The agreement. agreement. The agreement is is was oppor, oppor, opportunity. Fue I, oh, mm. you made an agreement. Yes. Yes. Uh, with for for money for <clears throat> money no no more other other uh, it was not a it was not a big crash big fresh it was not crash. it was not a big crash no fue un choque grande mm. Mm. Uh, no no re, no 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 reality, no realmente. No really. No, no really. No really, because You're... it's a problem with 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 these cars. It's a pet shot. Uh, the the uh, is uh, is difficult. The los repuestos. The parts. It's are, difficult are, to find the parts. Difficult, are difficult. Are uh, difficult. Uh, by uh, parts in the mer in the in the really busy on and maybe the two last week preparing all the activity and tomorrow it's going to be uh, this activity the the uh, Christmas dinner for the group for all the restaurant mm -hmm. hotels that are my group. Uh -huh. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's very nice. Yeah, and we are going to have a lot of food and yeah. a lot of booze, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of music, <laughs> a lot of booze, a lot of <laughs> booze. Who's? What do you mean? Nothing, Erwin, nothing. Who's? I'm kidding. 
what is what is the meaning of booze? Hard drinks. Ah, yeah, yeah. Beers and <laughs> liquors and <laughs> of course. So yeah. Okay, booze is Okay, let's see, guys. Let's see. Let's see. It was very nice. I was jumping from group to group and I found out some very interesting information. But we are not going to talk about that later. Let's see, guys. It was pretty interesting, very good activity. But now we are going to go to the manual. We are going to start unit four. And unit four is related to loyalty. So, first of all, uh, let me see just a second. I'm sorry, guys. Let's see. Let me get everything ready. Okay, we're gonna do the conversation from the manual. We're going to go to the manual to page number 32. Okay. But before going there, let's see, where's, where's, I haven't talked to some of you. Ambar, hello Ambar, how are you? Hello teacher, I'm fine, what about you? I'm just fine. Tell me Ambar about one of your classmates weekend. How was it? My weekend was good because I could spend time with my family and my friends. And uh, uh, actually, I was a very good weekend. I I could take a nap, uh, watch a series on Netflix. Actually, it was relaxed too. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Thank Maria Alejandra. Hi, teacher. <laughs> Hello, Maria Alejandra. Tell me not about your weekend. Tell me about one of your classmates' weekend. Ooh. You can tell me about Marta's weekend. Um, Marta, Roxana, and Yanira made. Uh -huh. <laughs> I went to a restaurant Saturday in the night and I eat a lot of and I have a good conversation I spend a lot of time and I don't know I think okay. <laughs> so you went to a party cool a party at food <laughs> okay okay well, you know, thank you, Maria Alejandra. All the good conversations start with Marta, Shanira, and Roxana, and you know that it's going to be cool. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Maria Alejandra. <laughs> Wilfredo Guardado. Hello, mister. Tell me about one of your classmates' weekend. Okay, teacher. I'm going to, to, to tell you about Wilfredo's weekend and Roxana's weekend. And okay. Fredo told us that he stayed at home working and he uh, he told me that he preferred uh, spend time with her wife with his, his, his wife his. and his yes his wife and and watch uh, movies with her then Roxana told me that she went over there because it's going to be necessary or because okay. two weeks ago you felt not so good she terrible, felt she but felt. she felt then she told us that she went shopping uh, when a 
she she had a dinner with with her friends and spent time with with her mom. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Mr. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> sure. And as usual. That's it. Behave. <laughs> Behave. No. So, yeah. Behave is good. <laughs> Misbehave is bad. Ah, okay. <laughs> but you see, I, I said I said that mm. she behaved good, and she said no, 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 no. I misbehave. That's bad. That's bad. Bar, Thank you guys. Bar, bar, bar. Thanks for sharing. <laughs> okay, welcome, teacher. Okay, guys. Let's see. Let's go to the manual. Okay. Remember, guys, we are working in page number 33 from the manual, uh, exercise number two. The instruction says read the conversation and take turns practicing it. Okay, as usual, let me get you the picture. Just a second. Okay, there you go. And the conversation goes like this. I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious. But when I visited their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simply put, the owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you're right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes. Consumers are aware of these brands and their images and names. In other words, this cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. I repeat, I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious, but when I visited their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simply put, the owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of these brands and their images and names. In other words, this cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Okay, guys. Let's go back to the groups so you can practice. Let's jump in, please. Teacher, I don't have a group. Yes, we do now. Okay.
Okay. I I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious, but when I visited their fan page, fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simply put, the owner of the brand aren't trying to have to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you are, you are right. Every know about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of this brand and their image and name. In other words, this cinnamon soda you're taking about need to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Let's start. Okay. Teacher, I, I have a question. What is the correct pronunciation that a uh, competitive? Sorry? Uh, teacher, uh, what is the correct pronunciation for competitive? Okay. Competitive. 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 Imagine that those T sound as a D, as a letter D. Competitive. Competitive. Very good. Like that. Okay. <laughs> El sonido de una D. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Well, uh, I start, Susana. I just okay. discovered this new brand on Cinnamon Soda. It's delicious. But when I visit their fan page, I saw, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it is a more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simply, simply put, the owners of the brand aren't try to how to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you're right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new store on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of these brands and they imagined a name. It's other words, the cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it's to get Reco Excuse me, teacher. Nothing, nothing. I haven't said nothing. Okay. <laughs> it to get high he hair, high hair, high hair cell and be become more competitive. Okay. Okay, Susana, you start. I just discovered this new brand on cinnamon soda. It's delicious, but when I visited their fans page, I saw, I saw they only have three under likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand, simple put. The owner of the brand aren't trying to hire to create brand awareness for the product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone 
and know about Coca-Cola and Pepsi. But I've never seen an, an app for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of this brand. Aware, are aware. Are aware, okay, thank you teacher. Well, Sylvia, hello, welcome. Hello, teacher. Hello. We were missing you here in class. Oh, thank you. <laughs> How are you? I am good, thank you. I just arrived home. I can imagine, I can imagine. I sent yeah. you the info you needed for the exercise. Did you get it? Oh, yes, yeah, thank you. No problem, no problem. I will try to do it again. Excellent. Yeah. Okay, guys, let's see, you ready? Okay, who's gonna be? Let's, let me check the order in which you are going to participate in the activity. Oops. Nicolas and Wilfredo Guardado, you start. Nicolás, Who is start? start? Okay. Sorry. Give me a minute, please. Uh, okay. I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious. But when I visited their front page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. Alfredo, activate your microphone, sorry. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Let's do it. It's probably an unknown brand, sample to the owners of the brand aren't trying to hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when I launch a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of the of those brands and their image and names. In other words, this cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Okay, guys, uh, let's see, Wilfredo, simply, simply, simply put. Okay, let's see, thank you very much, guys. Very well done. Thank you. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Hey, Jose Osorio, are you ready? Or not yet. That's not yet. That's fine. That's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. We got us here, Anna Claudia and Roxana. Anna Claudia, you'll start. Ah, okay, teacher. Just give me one minute. I'm getting the image. Okay. I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda is delicious. But when I visit their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. 
Simply put, the owner owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, customers are aware of this brand and their image names. In other words, this cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Okay, perfect. Yes, Roxana. Unknown, unknown. Unknown. And in the in the last word, the last word, the very last one, competitive. In this competitive. case, the letter T sounds as a D. Okay. Competitive. Compe competitive. competitive. Yep, like that. Perfect. Competitive. Yes, that's the sound. Okay. okay, thank you. You're welcome. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Next, Ambar. Oh, hello. And Sylvia. Okay, Me Ambar, start. you'll start. Okay. I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious, but when I visited their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it, it isn't more popular. Okay, I'll help you. It's probably an unknown brand. Simply put, the owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes. Consumers are aware of these brands and their images and names. In other words, the cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Thank you very much, Amber. Thank Fernando you, teacher. and Marta. Fernando, you'll start. Okay, teacher. <clears throat> I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious, but when I visited the fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably a no brand. Simply put, the owner of the brand are trying too hard to create brand. Awareness for their product. This is a very important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an app for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of this brand and their images and name. In other words, the cinnamon soda. You are talking about new to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Okay, thank you very much, Fernando Marta. Marta, aware of these brands. Okay, okay aware teacher, of you. these brands. Perfect, thanks to you. Walter and William. Let's see, Walter, you will start. Okay. I did discover this new brand. I'm cinnamon soda, it is delicious. And back when I visited your five pages, I said they only had to be on the flight. I wonder why it is so more popular. 
It's probably an owner brand. Simply put, the owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their products. This is very important when launching a new product. I get, <clears throat> I get you are right. And everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda TV. Well, yes, consumer and aware of this brand in their images and made. In other words, this cinnamon soda. We are talking about this to make people recognize it to take higher sales and become more competitive. Perfect. Very well done, guys. Both of you. Maria Alejandra and Susana. Susana, you will start. I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious, but when I visited their, their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simple folk put the owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes. Consumers are aware of these brand, brands and their image and names. In other words, the cinnamon soda you are talking about need to more people recognize, recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Recognize it. Recognize, recognize it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Erwin and Claudia, Claudia Ramos, you'll start. Okay, teacher. I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious. But when I visited Dave Pampish, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder, I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simply, uh, simply, put, <clears throat> simply put, the owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you're wrong. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Uh, well, yes, customers are aware of this brand, brands, and they imagine and names. In other words, this cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Very well done, both of you guys. Thank you. Francisco Eduardo and Jose Wilfredo. Francisco, you start. I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious. And when I visit, visit their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it is more popular. Please, Jose Wilfredo, continue. It's probably an unknown brand. Simply put, the owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new Sora on TV. Ye, well, yes, consumers are aware of these brands and their images and names. 
In other words, this cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Perfect. Let's see, Sylvia, are you ready now? Hello, teacher. Excuse are me. You ready? Are you ready for the conversation? Um, yes, I'm ready. Okay, do you want me to share the image in the screen? No, I, I, I get it. You got it. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Jose Osorio and Silvia. Jose Osorio, you'll start. I just discovered a new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious, but when I visited their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simply put, the owners of the brand aren't trying to aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is pretty important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an, an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of these brands and their images and names. In other words, this cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Perfect, guys. Very well done. Yes. Second, perfect. I got everything ready. Now, next activity. We go back to conversations. Would you like to have conversation? Where I'm going to get your groups. I have a couple of questions for you to do before we go back to the book. But I would like you to get uh, like to get out of the context of just the book. Last week was very heavy working with the manual and I need you to also, well, keep on practicing. So let me get you the question. I got a very interesting question for you right here. Okay, you know, now that we are in almost on holidays, people go out, you visit restaurants and stuff. And I got us a very, very interesting question. And is this one, look. What do you think of cost of the custom of giving a 15 from 15 to 18% tip in North America? What do you think? What's your opinion on this topic? Okay. Now, for you to discuss this topic, uh, I will divide you in five different groups. I'll send you to the group so you can discuss a little bit. Okay. Now let me check. The attendance teacher. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What? Okay, before we move, I'll get the attendance. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present teacher. Claudia Elizabeth Ramos Barrientos. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Erwin Francisco López Rojas. Present. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present, teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present, teacher. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Lucero Abigail Godínez. Present Lopez. teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. 
Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher, excuse me. William Giovanni Rosales. Present Gales. teacher. Present teacher. And Chanira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Okie dokie. Groups are created. Please, let's jump in. Okay, let's go see the groups discussing. The, in your uh, your payment, but you always give an extra extra tip, and they suggest that you give uh, around twenty or more dollars. And for Where? me, sorry. Where? In uh, in the um, hotels in in New York. The last time well, I was visiting New York and yeah, they, they suggest uh, a 20% tip. Yeah, but extra tip because you get a, a specific um, okay, plan, plan or specific yeah. um, paquete, I don't know. Package? And package, yeah. And uh, you have a um, service room, a buffet or something like that. So you pay a tip for that uh, service. Yeah, but, there's one tip that is included in the in the, in the service. Yeah, the but but they suggest that you give an extra tip. You have to give an extra tip for uh, the weather. Yeah. So well, in some places it goes like this, and they suggest you if. If you had a really, really good service, they suggest a 20%. If not, they suggest a minimum of a 10% tip. Okay. I remember that you can choose uh, when, you, uh, when you will pay, you can choose uh, the percent, but it's not in all places, just in a specific. Because uh, I remember uh, that if you pay the bill, uh, all the time you need to get that extra extra tip. Yeah. For, uh, and, the, yeah. and the funniest thing in the states is that they they give you a price, and when you go to pay the price, they add the taxes after they yes. give you the price. Yes. Yes. I mean, but I don't know why. It, I never understand that. How how don't they just set the price with taxes? Yeah, I know. I hate uh, spend money in New York, in, in North America, because 
you never have the specific price. Yeah, the exact. Yeah. It's complex, but uh, I remember that you you pay a tip in the in your bill, and you need to give an extra tip if you have yeah. a good service. Yeah, it, it, yeah. for me, that's it's the good expensive. thing of some countries in Europe. I mean, it's expensive, but yeah, they don't expect you to give to tip, and in yes. some of them, is it seems like really you tip. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes. And for example, in El Salvador, it's totally different. You can uh, give uh, two, three, four dollars, and it's okay. But yeah. when you visit North America, uh, some friends told me that if you give twenty dollars, the waiter are a uh, man because yeah. they uh, want to receive more. Yeah, I know. Well, now they yeah. see Salvador in some in some places they already include the tip. Yeah, but if you have a ex, uh, if you have a good service, yeah, you, you can, can get an extra tip. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know. And I mean, well, nowadays I mean people start tipping because I mean, uh, like in in my family, let's see, I am. I am very used to tip. I mean, it's normal. You know, it's mm -hmm. normal. You get used to it. Mm -hmm. You get yes. used to it. But here in El Salvador, it's not. It's not quite common in some places. I mean, there's yeah, people who never common. tip. <clears throat> no, but well, in my case, I try to do it. Um, because uh, when I ask for delivery, for example, sorry, guys, I tried to leave. Uh, um, if they notice that one of, of the waiter uh, uh, give them a good service, they appreciate this good service, giving a good tip too. Um, some some of my my personnel of my waiters, uh, maybe they obtain uh, in a good weekend two or three hundred dollars in, in, in this kind of uh, thing of, of the customer. Oh, hmm? yeah. But is be because it is the restaurant stay in the beach or is more common that the hermanos lejanos to visit and spend a lot of money and it's good for the winter when you recon recognize. Uh, recognize uh, William, I guess Fernando said it's a hide for them. Yeah, it's a habit. And the, the, the curious of, of this uh, story is that she is Salvadorian, but nowadays it's a habit for, for her. Mm. Good. Sorry, teacher. What is a habit? I'm sorry. Uh, I, I, had, I have friends on, in, in North America. Uh -huh. And uh, some days ago, she she told me about uh, the 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 man that helped help her to bring the the shop. Uh huh. And she gave she gave him ten dollar for for the favor because it's, it's, it's quite it's normal. A, uh -huh, it's it's a it's a friend and and I and I. And I asked her for for that, and she told me that it's a habit. Yeah. Well, you know, the funny thing is this, that in North America, some, some employments, actually, they are not that well paid. And supposedly, uh, the employees, they make up their salary from the tips they get. 
So that's why in some places they encourage you, they motivate you to tip, uh, even though a little tip is already charged in your bill. Okay. And I mean, and actually, like if you are like a, if you're in a in an establishment and you get your bill like in a restaurant or something, uh, if you had a good service, the recommendation is a twenty percent tip. Twenty percent. Oh. If you got, if you had a good. When the service is good, it's okay. Yeah, if you but had a, no. if you had a good service, if you didn't. They recommend at least a 10%. But always you you have to give, yep. give it. Yep, 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 yep. I hate that. But no, I don't hate tipping. I tip. I mean it's normal for me. But uh, what I hate, what I hate from, from some what I hate from the states is that they never give you the exact price of the stuff, you know. I mean you go buy you go you're going to buy something like a pair of shoes and you see a hundred dollars okay you get out a hundred dollars you say i want this pair of shoes you go to the cashier you're going to pay and they tell you okay it's a hundred and because all the prices that are displayed they don't have the taxes in yeah. yeah and depending on the state you the get amount different, is different different type of taxes yeah depending on the state you get different type of taxes this so is bad. a pair of shoes a pair of shoes that cost a hundred dollars uh, ends up being like 120 in another taste state is going to be 115 in another one is going to be 150 it's crazy yeah yeah it's bad but, it's the law there is complex for us to understand. I mean, but it's usual in all North America. For example, if you buy in, in eBay, it's the same thing. Yeah. Yeah, but what I mean is that uh, for me, I don't like that. I mean, why don't they just say this is the price? <laughs> like right here? Yeah. I mean, as simple as that. Yes, but it's not America, it's complicated. <laughs> they had other customs. Yeah. Yeah, you know, another country, another way of living. It's cultural. And in, in some countries, if you tip, you are insulting the person. Okay, guys, let's go to the main room. It's time. Okay, guys, now we go back again, but new topic. What is the ideal amount of sleep to get per night? Are you getting it? We're going to talk about the, the sleeping habits, okay? So for this five minutes, 
stops because when we come back, I'm going to start asking questions, but I will alternate the questions. So sleep. <laughs> well, I am in, in this age. And you, yeah. Amber? I think the best time for sleep is eight. Uh, and sometimes we that. Yeah, it's complex because it maybe you, you you want to sleep, but you can sleep because you have a lot of things in your mind. So I yeah, try I to sleep uh, seven hours, but I just get five or four sometimes. Okay, yeah, sometimes that happens because we can't sleep at night. That happened to me when I was younger um you are younger my dear yeah. younger <laughs> yes. really Sylvia? yeah when you were younger you know what when you were younger you were sleeping like 12 18 hours a day right Roxanne? yes <laughs> no the little babies sleep oh, that long the... in when wounds. i was like when yeah, I was, in, the, um, in your mama's warm, warm. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and it's, it's very necessary uh, use use time uh, of with silence, with silence. For example, prepare my videos and prepare my my report uh, for the for the students in the university. And my other my other job is all all day eight hours uh, at
Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who's going to help me? Erwin, you're going to start. Okay. Tell me, what is the ideal amount of sleep to get per night? Well, I understand that it's necessary to sleep eight hours every night. Are you getting it that amount of sleep? <laughs> no. And I think that nobody in this modern life, life is getting it. Um, I was commenting with the, my partners that one of my kids is having a home office in a call center and his, his schedule is uh, from 9 p.m. to 4 a.m. every night. So uh, it's difficult to have a good sleep with this kind of schedules. Uh, in my case, with my job in, in a restaurant, it's a lot of work too. If, if you uh, pretend to sleep every night, eight hours is impossible. Okay, perfect, thank you. Fernando, what do you think about it? What is the ideal amount of sleep to get per night? Uh, but the ideal uh, for, I don't know, the, the, a lot of people is eight hours per night, but uh, for me, it's not. I, since university, I lost the, the skill of sleep more than six hours. So for me, six or seven hours is enough. Seven hours? Yeah, seven hours or six is the top for me. You are a lucky man if you can sleep seven hours every night. <laughs> yeah, I, I sleep uh, less than that <laughs> sometimes because when I I had to go to the office, I work, work, I wake up to I don't know at 4 a.m. and every day I, I go to bed at midnight or uh, around. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Let's see. Ana Claudia. Yes, teacher. Okay, tell me, what do you think of the custom of tipping in North America? Uh, I think if that is a custom for them, it's okay. And if it's something uh, they want to reproduce when they visit in different countries, it's okay. It's their money and it's good. They recognize the service for a waiter if they have a good service or not. It depends on them to leave the tip. But if it's a habit for them, it's okay. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now we are going to talk about food. Do you remember last week we were talking about food? Today we are going to talk about food. But we are going to analyze a little bit about our food. Okay. So, is your country's cuisine healthy? What do you think? What's your opinion? Could you give some examples? Those are the ideas that I want you to be discussing. You will have five minutes assigned to your groups. Please jump in.
is a very chilates. Chilates. Yeah, Sería, how do you say grasoso? Grasoso. Um, I don't know. Mm, fatty. Fatty food. <laughs> fatty food. Yeah. But if, uh, it's fried uh, because all of them are fried. Most of them. The best I think this food uh, don't be daily food, but sometimes or one day per week. It's not bad. Yeah. Yes, you're right. I agree uh, with that. Pupusas on Sunday or Saturday night, it's not bad. <laughs> yeah. Depending quantity. Time. I guess the problem is uh -huh, the quantity or when we breakfast. Oh, how many pupusas do you eat, Anna? Me? Just two. Yes. Every time I eat pupusas, just two. Two pupusas. Only two. It's complex. Because... Welcome to the group. Another question, guys. Did you get it? Eh, no. No la veo. Ah, ya la vi. Ya <laughs> cayó. I don't know, but I don't like to eh, prepare. <laughs> ah, okay. Um, revueltas. Next Mix. question. Revueltas es, es un nombre propio, Tich. Mix. 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 Okay, mix. I just texted you the next question, okay? Okay, teacher. But, <laughs> hello, guys. But, uh, hello, teacher. Hello, I got teacher. another question for you. Hello. Okay. What do you worry about the safety on the food that you are hit? What one do you bite? Okay. I know the center of center of the church. He 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 was in food or product like that, you can get a illness. Señor, no está viendo. Quién? 
Hi. Welcome to Hi. the group, teacher. I sent you the next question. Did you get it? Otra. No. Quiero ver. Ay, me salí. Do you worry about the safety of the food you eat? What want you buy? Yes, we are talking about that. Okay, perfect. And that's it. I think that uh, the safety of the food is important because, um, for example, if you are visit a restaurant and you, you need to pay, and sometimes you need to pay a, I don't know, high price and you need to quality and good food. And if you are paying and don't receive um, something like that, I don't know, it's, it's complex because you can get uh, illness or, I don't know, you, you, you have, uh, you, you, you are mad or something like that. What do you think, William? I always I need excellent good food, este, a lot of quality in, in each uh, product. Always, always. It's very important. Uh, the healthy in, in his the product, the, how do I click on? Alimenta, teacher. Food. Mm -hmm. And his food, always healthy. Okay, and what about you, Silvia? What do you think? I wish the question is, do you worry about the safety of the food you eat? No? Yes. No, I am not worried about the food, the safety. Oh, yes, I am safety of the food I eat. Uh, I just prepare the food here at home, but I don't like to get food prepared on the streets or some juice prepared on the streets because those are not well prepared yeah. it's not safety to drink any kind of food and when i go to a restaurant i make sure that everything is clean because there are some restaurants that doesn't look very clean or they don't follow the the bio safety protocols so they are not wearing a face
Okay, guys. Well, I hope you really, really enjoyed your activity. I passed by some groups checking out and you have a very nice conversation. Now let's see, Ambar, where are you, Ambar? Hello. Tell me, Ambar, do you worry about the safety of the food you eat? Um, sometimes yes, and sometimes not. It's depending about their, uh, the, the place. For example, if it's one place and I don't know it, I, I try to um, have reference about this place before yeah. they get reference. I got I get reference before they eat here. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, Ambar. Thanks for sharing. Thank you. Let's see, Maria Alejandra, what about you? Do you worry about the safety of the food you eat? Yes, teacher. I think that yes, I worry a lot for the for when buy a, a food is the safety because I don't eat a lot of I, a lot of type of food because I don't like all all types or kinds of food. <laughs> And when I buy, I try to buy in stores or different uh -huh, stores to, I think uh, the food is safe. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Guys, I really hope you enjoy the activities and the conversation part tonight. Tomorrow, we are going to have a little bit reading of comprehension, some exercises, a little explanation of vocabulary from the manual and hopefully we will have like 20 25 minutes for this type of exercise again so we can practice the speaking okay let me get the attendance one more time and barely alfaro gomez ana claudia gonzalez velasquez claudia lizeth ramos barrientos Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Erwin Francisco Lopez Rojas. Present teacher. Thank you, Erwin. Present. Fernando Marvin González Martinez. Thank you, Ana Claudia. Present teacher, sorry. Thank you, Ambar. And did you hear mine? I was Yes, I did. <laughs> Thank you. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. José Wilfredo Ayala Sorco. Present teacher. Lucero Abigail Godínez. Present, 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 present. Thank you, you José Wilfredo. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Apilio Méndez Granados. Present teacher. Oxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Arandaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Ingeniera Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Okay, guys, it was a pleasure for me. Welcome to this last week of classes. Hope to see you tomorrow on time. Please remember working on the platform and 
be always positive because we are always going to have fun in this class and many conversations. Thank you very much for being such a good group. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Thank you, teacher. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Hello. Hello. You don't Good breathe, evening. right? <laughs> no, Peter. I'm sorry. Okay. I was wondering, how come you got an A2? I was wondering? How come you got A2? No, 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 no. ¿Cómo es que tuvo un A2? No sé. Tell me the type of test you took. ¿Qué tipo de examen tenés? Solo me acuerdo que decía SF, creo, o EFF. No sé, uno de LinkedIn que me enviaron. To be honest, I think that uh, I can't um, listen in or read things in English. And I need to develop that okay well listening comprehension and reading and you okay. know the last week it was it was weird i'm not in my best time and i need to get the exams for a new job but i I didn't send the result because it's not a good result. Okay, okay I'll help you with some, some ideas, something that could be very helpful for you. We will check out vocabulary level. We are going to check uh, grammar listening comprehension or reading comprehension and we will see we will see there are some activities that we are developing as a group that actually in the class that actually are like helpful for uh for getting better or for improving in those specific areas but still as i tell you we need to we need to reevaluate how's your your improvement because actually I feel you have improved, but 
we will see some things that happens that perhaps you're improving in one area, but we are leaving behind some other areas. Mm -hmm. where we try to level them up and that's why i'm going to check out first uh, uh, i'm going to go over all everything i have my notes according to what i'm checking you out how you are working in classes and everything and to see which specific areas we need to to work on because everything I, no but i mean a B1 could have been acceptable. B1 is okay. But A2, I think, I think you took the exam not in the best day for you. Yeah, and in my opinion, to be honest, I think that the exams are created to evaluate a, a, okay, advanced models or something like that because they are talking about so fast or uh, well, they are count they are count the, the time and you have a pressure about that then you need to check the time and read and no, analyze it's, and uh, it's normal it's normal that's the way they are the thing is that we are not prepared for taking exams for taking that type of exams because it's normal. All those exams are like that. It's it's the norm. Es la norma. Okay. Van okay. con tiempo. Este, van rápido. Los listening. Los textos van cambiando. Este, pero son una norma. O sea, así se hace. Es la manera como se hace. Solo que en algunas ocasiones, en algunos sucede de que si usted está contestando un nivel más bajo, las preguntas comienzan a ser más fáciles. Uh -huh. Pero si usted contestó una pregunta difícil, la siguiente es más difícil. Es más difícil. Uh -huh. so far, so long. La idea es ver hasta qué nivel llega. Okay. Uh -huh. Van de A1, A2, B1, B2, C1, C2. Y si está en C2, es bilingüe. Creo que tuve 38. Sí, y eh, para el B1 era 40, creo. Algo así. Sí, o sea, pero me B, quedé. En... A B1 es ok, es intermediate. A's are basic, B's are intermediate, and C are advanced. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay. But we will see. Vamos a ver entonces, este, déjenme ver. Mañana es. Martes, salgo, salgo, miércoles, salgo todo el día, jueves, salgo por la tarde. No, no, no. This week is crazy for me. Quite no. crazy. No, not a word. Uh, but I'll see, I'll see how I can help you, okay? Don't worry about it. But I okay. need you to be like, like focused, like. Like if I if I start pushing you, I want you to 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 really give me back, okay? Okay. Okay. What about my be good? Y deje de andar arruinándome la otra niña. <laughs> no, yo no. Fue una salida tranquila, teacher. Solo fue una cena tranquila. We hope so. Have a good night. <laughs> Bye. Take care. Good night, teacher. Thank you. You're welcome.
Okay, well, that was a very, very interesting class. See you tomorrow.